So I guess everyone has seen some of the amazing desk PC creations that are out there on the internet. Most of them has giant pieces of glass with water cooling, lots of lights and everything. Today I'm gonna do just that, but with a twist. Now before I could get started with cutting wood and everything else, I of course need to have a plan like in every project. So I threw together a sketch in Cinema 4D which looks something like that. As you can see, the desk I'm trying to build is going to be a corner desk, as I have a perfect spot for a corner desk here in my studio. Also, I don't really like the desk PCs where the center of attraction is right in the middle of the PC, because that's also where you have your keyboard, your mouse, your mouse pad, and it's really a bummer if you have to cover up the such nice parts of your PC with other things. So I decided to move the PC to the right and left side of my setup. This then gives me just a normal wooden surface in the middle where I can put a big mouse pad in keyboard without covering anything up. Now because I of course don't have a giant PC where I need two big boxes on either side, in one of the boxes will be my server. This isn't going to be water cooled but it'll look cool anyways. But the main attraction of course is going to be my PC which will be custom water cooled with everything you can imagine and that's going to come in a few further parts. But now let's get to actually building the desk itself. So that it is a bit easier to work with I decided to first make a body out of MDF where I then can attach everything else. The insides where the PC go, they will be painted black to give a nice contrast with my orange and silver color scheme. And the wooden parts that you can see on the outside and the tabletop in the middle, they will be covered with reclaimed wood, so it gives it the whole thing a bit of a rustic feel. So first off, I went to the hardware store and got all the MDF I needed, which was quite a lot. And I also got myself a circular saw in order to be able to cut really straight lines, which with a jigsaw isn't really possible. And so with that done, I could cut the main pieces. What you can see me cutting and preparing here are the parts for the two boxes on either side where the PC will go in. You can see that they are constructed with four pieces around and the bottom piece. For that I'm using 90mm MDF as it is really strong but not quite as heavy as like 22 or even thicker. In order to hold this box together I glued it and also drove in some screws because I didn't have clamps that are big enough to clamp something like that. So I put in some screws to hold it together while the glue dries. In order to give me some room for cable management and to hide some more ugly stuff I also put in a second floor in these boxes which is made out of 10mm MDF. In the box for the server this floor is a bit higher up because I don't have a graphics card that is really high that I have to put in and so I don't need quite as much space. This then allows me to put the power supply on the bottom there. On the PC side the bottom compartment is rather small of, and it's like 3 centimeters and the power supply won't be able to fit there, so I will have to put it on the side somewhere. 
For the corner piece I just took a big square part where I cut off two corners. The front one is the face where I will be sitting and in the back I also cut off the corner so that the desk doesn't go quite back into the corner because I have some acoustic treatment there and it isn't necessary as I won't be able to use this space anyways as I can't reach like one and a half meters down. And the cutoff that I got from this task I cut up in little triangles that I can use to mount things together that need to be square. Now as you were able to see in the 3D model I showed you before, in the centerpiece there is a little thing on the top where I can have like stuff like um, my buttons or I have the I.O. for the PCs. I will also mount my audio interface there. There will be a reservoir that is visible and it gives me some place to hide cables and other stuff. In order to make that I cut off the top and the front portion of it out of 10mm MDF and I cut some triangular parts that will give it the shape. These parts were an absolute nightmare to make because they had some extremely weird angles that I didn't calculate so it was a lot of trial and error and quite a lot of sand in the end. But it turned out great and now it looks absolutely stunning because it just fits. Now that I have the basic boxes and structure, I started making some holes in them for the PC stuff. First I cut a cutout in the bottom compartment where I can route the cables out, out of the desk into like the cable management area or to my monitors or wherever. To give the glass panels on the either side a bit of more space to rest on and in order to um, mount some LEDs under it and cover up the ugly faces of the MDF and the reclaimed wood, I also cut some strips that I will assemble in a square frame which is going to go on top of the two boxes. As you can see this looks kind of like the model already and it is also as far as how I'll go into this episode. In the next few episodes I will complete this desk and in order to not miss those you can subscribe down below. If you want to see live where I'm at and what I'm doing you can check out the link to the Modsu forum where I am posting build logs right away when they are finished. So you can see some pictures and text there earlier than the video on YouTube will go up. I also have Twitter and Instagram handles linked down below if you want some other behind the scenes footage. Thanks for watching and until next time.